In this video, we'll discuss gluten, ADHD, and autism. ADHD, Attention Deficit Hyperactivity Disorder, is on the rise. It is difficult to diagnose and treat, but, as the name implies, it involves the amount of hyperactivity in children. The connection between celiac disease and ADHD is still being studied, but doctors and parents have noticed that both are connected to food allergies and or food intolerance. Interestingly, around 70% of ADHD sufferers have a sensitivity to gluten. We know that the frontal brain lobe, which is in charge of memory and planning activity, is impaired with people with ADHD. It is also known that gluten can affect that very area of the brain. Therefore, more and more researchers and doctors are treating ADHD by omitting gluten from the diet. Kids with ADHD react differently when gluten is removed from their diet, but the results have been quite incredible. The kids have become less hyperactive and enjoy decreases in mental confusion. In each study, the researchers found that giving up gluten resulted in improved brain function in all cases. When the connection between autism and gluten was studied, Two-thirds of the children showed improvement once they were no longer eating gluten. They are still working to connect the two factors, but the results have astounded them. They cannot be denied. One of the challenges for parents, of course, is picky eaters. Some children are extremely adamant in what they will eat and what they won't go near. They may only eat one kind of food or even food of one color. Kids with ADHD may also react negatively to sugar, so parents need to remove both from their diet. In a 2006 study, 132 participants were tested for celiac disease and ADHD. Subsequently, the participants were given a diet free of gluten for six months. When the researchers checked them after that time period, they found that many participants with undiagnosed celiac disease also had ADHD. They concluded that a diet free of gluten could benefit these participants. Celiac disease sufferers complain of many of the same discomforts and symptoms as ADHD sufferers do. This may include headaches, difficulty in focusing, abdominal pain, and others. Researchers have noticed such an overlap in symptoms that some believe that anyone tested for celiac disease should automatically be screened for ADHD. Of course, not all people with ADHD suffer from celiac disease, but may still benefit from a gluten-free diet. The reason is that a gluten-free diet, when properly adhered to, should be more nutrient-dense than the average diet. This means that someone with ADHD on a gluten-free diet will be eating less processed foods and consume more healthy meats, fish, and produce, and see symptoms improve as a result. All too frequently, when kids with ADHD go to school, the gluten-free diet is given up as unsustainable. These kids find it difficult to sit for lengthy periods of time. This forces them back on medication. A number of parents have solved the problems by reinstituting a gluten-free diet. Yes, it's hard to control kids when they are in school. Parents have found that the kids improved enough to have their medication lowered considerably. Gluten-free and autism. So far, there has been too little research on autism and gluten-free diets. Autism is a disorder of the brain which can make it difficult for a child to communicate and socialize. Stony Brook University researchers studied 59 children diagnosed with autism and 44 of their non-autistic siblings. The children's family were to record all of their food intake and take stool samples. The researchers found that almost half of the autistic children and 30% of the non-autistic siblings suffered from gastrointestinal disorder. These numbers are much higher than found in the general population of children. Since gastrointestinal issues involve the small intestine, Researchers have concluded that a gluten-free diet may prove beneficial. If your child suffers from ADHD or autism, 
discuss the possibility of a gluten-free diet with his or her pediatrician. While more studies need to be conducted, placing your child on a healthy, gluten-free diet won't hurt him or her, and it might help. Be sure to discuss any specific dietary changes with your child's doctor. Beware of chocolate. Kids love chocolate, and you don't want to deprive them. The good news is, you and the kids don't have to give up your favorite sweet on a gluten-free diet. You just have to pick the right chocolate bar. Some are gluten-free, others are not. The problem isn't chocolate, as the cacao bean is naturally gluten-free. However, most candy bars add a number of ingredients, and that's what you need to watch out for. A rule of thumb is that the more ingredients in a chocolate bar, the greater chances there will be a wheat byproduct. Chocolate bars that contain cookie are off limits. Malt balls are made with malt and contain gluten. Milk chocolates, such as Hershey's Milk Chocolate Bar, is made with milk and is gluten-free. When it comes to white chocolate, you need to read the labels. Generally, white chocolate is made with sugar and shea butter and is gluten-free, but that does not apply to every brand of white chocolate. Lindt's white chocolate contains gluten, while Ghirardelli's white chocolate baking bar does not. While many chocolate manufacturers make gluten-free chocolate, they use the same equipment to manufacture their gluten-free chocolates without cleaning the machines, thereby risking cross-contamination. However, chocolate lovers can relax. There are a number of safe, gluten-free chocolates on the market. Alter Echo. Almost all of their premium chocolates are gluten-free. Nestle Milk Chocolate is gluten-free. Dove Chocolate. These chocolates contain no gluten. Enjoy Life Chocolate. These chocolate bars are manufactured on gluten-free equipment and are totally gluten-free. Hershey's. The famous Hershey Kisses and the Hershey Milk Chocolate are gluten-free. Their other candies may contain gluten. Scharfenberger Chocolate makes both dark and milk chocolate bars that are gluten-free. Vosges Hout Chocolate makes chocolates with some interesting flavors, most of which are gluten-free. Check the label. To keep your child from being tempted by chocolate when among friends, Tuck a few satisfying Hershey's Kisses in his or her bag. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.